welcome to the cold start video for the 1975 Triumph TR6 2.5. This one has had the Stromberg carburetor conversion, which is quite a popular one because the old PIs do need a bit of setting up. Right, the car is stone cold. If you'd like to start it up, so it's pulling out the choke. TR6 2.5. So this had the carburetor conversion to make it run a bit nicer. And it's also got a five-speed gearbox. Phil thinks it's a Toyota gearbox, but he's not 100 percent sure, but whatever it is a five-speed. And it sort of makes the cruising a bit easier, a bit nicer. And it goes in and out of the gears beautifully, doesn't it? Absolutely spot on. Lovely. So you spent some money on this car since you've owned it, haven't you? I have. What did you spend it on? Oh, uh, electrics, uh, carburetor rebuilds. Uh, the carburetors needed a lot of work going on, so it's all done now. Um, mainly uh, electrics and carburetor rebuild. There's other things like suspension. Yeah. Uh, they've done. Um, but we got we got photos of the invoices for all this work, we haven't have, we? Have. Yeah. Lovely. Um, and it's got a new heater fan here, so that's the, oh, the that control the switch for that. The car is basically, I think, before Phil bought it, had been fully restored. It looks like it's had a nut and bolt restoration done on it. And it's, I would say, the blue is probably, call it baby blue, but it's probably the golf racing blue. Yes, it yeah. looks very yeah. similar to that. Yeah. Um, in beautiful condition, the panel fit is absolutely gorgeous. The colour is suits it really well, and of course the six-cylinder does sound absolutely lovely. It's got twin pipes coming out, twin separate pipes at the back, rather than what the original one had—the two pipes close to each other, didn't they? The, the sort of single back box. I think you've got two back boxes on this. Yeah, it drives really nicely. Um, carpet's all nice, seats are good. Um, as you can see from the photos, the hood which we have just taken down just to finish off doing the photography of the car. Went down really nice and easy and folded up and we've got the proper tonneau cover on it now. Yeah, the summer of 24. Right, anything else that you'd like to say to help? When was the car last MOT'd? Oh, uh, it was MOT'd about three, four months ago. Okay. Um, and still got current MOT running. Yeah. Um, so I can't remember the exact date. Okay, don't worry about that. And what about the steering? Does that all feel nice yeah, on it? Yeah, yeah. It's obviously heavy because it's got no assisted um, No, of course steering, not, so, no. But it's a uh, 74 car, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Right, that's lovely. Well, I think that can conclude, hopefully, um, um, oh, sorry, one more thing. What's the clutch like on the car? It's good. The clutch is okay. Yeah. Is, it he is it heavy or...? No, no, it's, it's not heavy at all, no. I suppose it's probably quite a new clutch in this thing, so it's, it's, that. it's had a new slave cylinder and a new master cylinder. Right. I'm not sure about the actual clutch itself, but there's no slipping. It feels absolutely fine. Good. Excellent. Lovely. Right, well, I think that can conclude the video then. Um, hopefully that gives you all the information you need to place your bid on the car. Um, and hopefully the weather will be a bit nicer when you come and pick it up. So good luck, Phil. Thank you. 
Thank you. And good luck to the new buyer too.